So following on from my last video, the grouping is also important for the chase and spin effects. So here we have a chase and it's got five trees under it. So that chase effect will then apply to the sub node. So when we overlay the preview, we've got a chase of five and it's going to our five trees, which are symbolized by those triangles in the preview. It's also important, uh, this depth level setting will affect it if you've got subgroups under that again. Same for the spin effect. So for the bell animation, if we bring back the preview, we can see we're switching between the two and that's just rotating one effect at the top level and it's switching between the two child nodes. Now another handy feature is you can actually have uh, groups or elements within your display duplicated. So I've got this chase effect at my mini star level for the top of a Christmas tree. And it's currently arranged by basically rung. So we start, we've got a chase effect and we've got the center rung, the next one out, the next one out, the next one out. So if we look at this cheat sheet of channels, we'll just get that on the screen properly. It basically starts from the center and works our way out. Now, we can also animate this by spinner effect. So then we have 1, 13, 12, 11, then these ones, these ones, these ones, and these ones. Now we can animate that, but basically I have the channels duplicated, but in a different order uh, down below for various elements. So if we go back to find it in the sequence, here we go. We've got similar or the same physical element, but then it's regrouped from within our display editor. So then it's arranged by spokes on the star and then a single, the same chase effect then applied at this level makes it a spinner instead of the exploding effect. So if we expand those out, we can then see the individual uh, display nodes. And if we go back up the top, whereas when it's by rung, it's a different grouping. So then if we go back to the display editor where it's originally set up, we we'll just wait for that to load up under all RGB house front, it's buried in here. Our mini star, then we've got the grouping done that way. And then to duplicate, it's a matter of taking them originally. You can uh, hold down shift you can copy. This originally started off with the whole lot under one group and then we're pasting it down the bottom and I've put it under the reordered and I call it uh, mini star one and then by spokes. So there's a few other ones in here for a lot of them are only used for one particular song. Um, 